he forgave people for what they've done to him. He's more focused, resourceful, and speaks for the voiceless. He hears for the deaf, and he sees for the blind. He's humble with powerful confidence and a soft touch. He's many different things and doesn't change to please anyone. Knowing him is not understanding him, and showing him is not helping him. His mind is healing, and he doesn't trust anyone. He thinks before he speaks, and speaks his mind openly. He struggles responding to the intrusive thoughts he receives. He wants permission, validation, and freedom to be himself. He wants women with high standards to step up and make the first move. He doesn't like illusions, confusion, or deception, and he doesn't expect every conversation to be clear. He likes maturity, conservativeness, and natural energy. He ignores subliminal indirect signals. He doesn't like how people use social media. He gets distracted with the ideas of the women on his mind. He doesn't know what to do when he doesn't need to do anything. He's anxious and being still makes him feel useless. He doesn't listen to people he can't learn from. He doesn't go out of his way to be near anyone. He isolates himself, trying to conserve his resources. He doesn't like feeling vulnerable. He gives the shirt off his back and doesn't know how to get another one and he'll walk without a shirt instead. He suffers and doesn't complain. He doesn't reflect on the bad things that he's been through. He moves forward instead and uses the past as learning experiences. He dreams of things that may seem ridiculous he believes anything is possible with consistency and discipline. He doesn't compare himself to anyone. He doesn't compete with anyone, especially to feel successful. His definition of perspectives is different and he doesn't waste time trying to make people understand. He doesn't like women that sell their body. He's not attracted to ugly personalities and the beauty is in the eye of the beholder. He doesn't like belligerence or ignorance, and he tries to understand the perspective of others before forming an opinion. He cries when he gets angry, and he fights depression with smiles. His memories traumatize him, and certain flashbacks make him angry. He remembers what happened to him. He doesn't know how he survived other than by the grace of God. He makes sense of the ideas and memories he has, he defends his friends and family for asking God to forgive them for the things that they do or they say. He ignores mixed signals and fake love from people that ask him to do what they're not capable of doing themselves. He's known in the streets and gets love outside that he keeps there because his home is not the streets. He doesn't like having the mind he carries outside in his home. His mother suffered through hell with his father he grew up seeing her cry, and he's seen all the men in his family abuse, disrespect, destroy, and laugh in the faces of the women that he sees as mothers. He's affectionate and loves making love. He finds pleasure pleasing women and making them smile. He gets aroused and motivates himself because he wants to get married and have companionship. He doesn't want any relationship. He wants someone that'll help him feel how he makes her feel.